On losing his mind to the mighty Satians, the respect of his Akuma brothers, and everything he held dearly, he didn't give up. He wandered through the world with nothing but a single eye. Not being able to awaken his samurai spirit, he had given up on being a Shindo. And upon hearing the death of his previous sensei, Bankai Akuma, he knew something was wrong. The home he had, Ember, was being manipulated by the ones who betrayed him. Ember was heading down a different path, a path which he could not allow. Forged felt a call to action. Months have passed as Forged rebuilt himself. He realized he didn't have the strength needed for changing Ember. A mysterious figure appeared before Forged. Do you want the power to change this accursed world? My brothers couldn't understand my reasoning, my ideals. What makes you think that you'll understand me? On Bankai's deathbed, his last wish was to rewrite his wrong. Alfarama Akuma, Satori Akuma, and Eva always checked up on you because of Bankai's final wishes. He wanted you to make something of yourself. The sky suddenly turned red. The clouds dark. Forged was given a decision. A decision that will forever affect the Shindo world. Months have passed. Chaos, wars, and the fall of the Samurai Order. A world engulfed with the Third Great Shindo War. I used to look up at these two statues and think that someday I'll make a difference in this world. There is no difference. Only corruption. Only twisted ideology. Only cries of newborns bred for war. The greatest gift was stripped away from me. My family, my brothers, everyone turned their backs on me. For a simple mistake. Now I will show them their greatest misfortune. A misfortune of loneliness. If I'm here... Dead. All right, I got him. So what do we get after this? A scroll. Forge companion. What else? Guys, where is going to be that scroll? Oh no, the bloodline. Bloodline scroll. Give me that bloodline. 